Fishing, everyone. My name is Billy. For those who are new here today, we are in Newport News, Virginia, currently at the James River Pier. And I'm literally just got here, gonna unload, and then we'll get out there and fish and see what we can get. And then before I even start the video, I want to mention that when you park here, park on the left side because that's for the pier. On the right is for the restaurant. So keep that in mind as well. So let's get started. Good start already. Someone got a stingray so far this morning. Just walked on the bridge here or the pier. Nice stingray. Cow noise. Check out the sea bass that caught off camera. It has a fish in his mouth. Check out. Put some more lugworms on here on a high low rig. What do we got here? It looks like a croaker. It pulls like a croaker, so and it is a croaker, nice size croaker too. You gotta be careful because of the gill spikes right here. Get him on the ice. Come on now. There we go. All right. Looks like some crabs tore this pinfish head up. I'm gonna change it out for that spot I cut up or caught and then cut up. Let's put a fillet on here. Show you my setup. It's kind of like a Carolina rig. But I have some leader right here to the sinker, it's, so it doesn't sit directly off the bottom. It has some clearance, and that's just less likely to snag compared to a Carolina rig. Trying to get some bluefish or something here. I'm about a jig next to this pillar right here or piling. Gotcha. We back with the double up. Uh huh. I'm telling you guys, jigging that pole or jigging the piling into the cooler, these guys go. Some took it, threw it towards the piling over there. Let's see what we got here though. Ooh, that's a nice one. Spot. Fat, fat spot. Oh yeah, that's good eats right here. We got a crab. I think he's mating. There's like two crabs on top of each other. Let's rebait it and then throw it towards that piling again. That's a big spot. <laughs> Round two. Perfect. All right, fishing has been pretty slow. So we got a pop tart break here. Slack tie. A little crabbing or something. Got a net. <laughs> we got a bite, guys. you guys 
best flavor pop tart strawberries don't at me no bluefish today been working them the gotcha plug throwing some cut bait no bites at all gotcha plug here I have no idea what it is oh whoa, whoa, whoa. it's probably stingray come on yep big stingray <laughs> I snagged it on my gotcha plug that's not good that's not good I don't even know how to take this guy out here Yeah. There's no way I'm bringing this guy up. If someone has a net. All right, I'm gonna cut the GoPro here. I'm trying to work on this fish. Yeah, I got his wing. Go under the bridge. Ay, 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 ay. Come on now, come on. All right, guys. I didn't show you guys, but I had to pop it off. I just cuffed my spool and pulled a gotcha plug off. Well, gotcha plug's still on him, but I tried to bend the trebles off because I've been using that gotcha for a long time now. It has rust on it, but. It didn't want to budge off, so hopefully it'll come off eventually. The hooks are already rusted, very rusted actually. Yeah, looks like my knot did not fail. It just tension broke it. Time to put the last one on. Basically, I'm throwing to the shadow line right now. Here we go again, here we go again. Most definitely a spot. Yep. I'll take them all day. Got this little baby flounder off camera because he took off my rod so I couldn't turn my GoPro on but he smoked that lug worm. small rigs small setups I always use my tsunami slim wave this is the six foot one paired with a 3k stratic FJ and this is power pro 30 pound max quadro so it's like the diameter of a 10 pound braid pretty much but I have the strength of 30 pounds so that's a great thing and I can pull in more because it's so thin uh, then I have a high low rig right now with uh, really small hooks I don't know what the size is but and I use cannonball sinkers because it snags less. This is uh, two ounce, I believe, which is overkill, but that's what I have right now, and this is my setup. Just had to buy here. There we go, he's back for it. Came back. There we go, getting nibbles. Come on, take it. 
There we go, got him. <laughs> Feels big. It's probably another spot. Or a big croaker. What is this? Oh my god, that's a jumble spot. <laughs> oh gosh. My goodness, it's probably like biggest spot I caught this year. Look at that. Croc for reference, hold up. That's the size of my crocs. Look at that. Nice and purple. Ah, very nice. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Yeah. Came back for it. Got him this time. Gotcha this time. Oh, or not. I lied. Came off. We'll get him back. We'll get him back. We will get him back. Yep. Came back for it. Came back for it. We got him back. Gotta get more bait. Some crabs or something been tearing up my head. The head of a, a cut spot here I put on. Look at that. Destroyed it. Definitely crabs for sure. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned to the next video. Remember to smash that like button, give us a comment, and subscribe. Everything I use is under the description below, so check that out as well. Yeah.